What's up guys, JP here, and uh, this is going to be a video response to Richard, um, aka Horror Show 3000. If you don't know who he is, uh, the link will be below. Definitely go sub him. Uh, awesome guy. Everybody needs to be subbed to this dude. Um, very entertaining videos. Very funny. Um, you know, I, I watch all of his videos. Uh, you know, great horror guy, and uh, I'm sure everybody subbed to him, but if not, definitely you need to sub to this guy. And... Uh, yeah, so uh, let, let's get into it. Uh, it's a horror con contest, uh, Christmas themed, um, similar, you know, like last uh, couple months ago with his Halloween one. Uh, another awesome contest here. The question that he asked, um, this is going to be my video response for it, obviously, but uh, the question he asked is, um, what is your favorite horror movie, Christmas horror movie moment? And uh, so it, it's not your favorite Christmas horror movie, but your favorite moment. Um, right when he said this, I pretty much knew what mine was, but then I had to kind of think about it because I'm not quite sure if this qualifies, but uh, I'm going to take the chance anyway. Um, l l let me give a little bit of backstory because it's 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 the moment plus it's the memory of the moment that make this such an awesome experience. Um, and I try to hold I try to hold on to this memory because you know this is one of my favorite memories growing up uh, dealing with like horror movies and stuff uh, I, I always remember this it's, it's so nostalgic thinking about it so I lived in this um, old 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 house it was a, it was a really old house it was uh, part of like one of those mining communities uh, you know where I forget what they called those uh, things it's been a while since I learned about them in school and stuff and uh, there was just a bunch of houses that were really old uh, that you know miners used to live in. You know they'd go mi they'd go to their mining job, come home, and they'd all pretty much live in the same like uh, town. It was like a little mining town and stuff. And the houses were, were really old. You know um, they were they were really really old. And uh, the one the one that I lived in was probably the oldest. And um, it, it was a big house, and it was it was an old house. And I remember in my room. Uh, my room was big and, and cold because uh, the houses were really old. For some reason, that meant that they were cold. <laughs> um, I, I don't know if it was what it was, but they had they all had these like drafts in them that made them. Uh, they were really chilly and stuff. But uh, so it was it was a cold uh, morning. It was during Christmas break. I was probably in you know sixth grade or below um, because I was still in elementary school. I remember that I was chilling in my room. Uh, laying on the floor or sitting on the floor or something early in the morning. I just woke up a little bit before that. It was like 6 or 7 in the morning. And I was on the floor for some reason. I don't know. Kids do that stuff. They sit on the floor and watch TV. But uh, I was watching TV and uh, I was flipping through the channels and Tales from the Crypt was on. Which, uh, you know, you guys, some of you guys probably know where I'm going with this. But uh, Tales from the Crypt was on. And I loved that show, you know, I, I remember it when it was airing on HBO, but uh, this was a little bit after that, and uh, I wanted, it was on one of the TV stations, I can't really remember, but um, yeah, so this is why I'm not sure if it, you know, it counts, because it's not really a horror movie, it's an episode of a TV show, and uh, but it is horror themed, I, it's kind of a short film if you think about it, so hopefully this counts, uh, but it was from season one, you guys who have seen this show probably know what I'm talking about. It is uh, the Christmas um, themed episode, uh, and all through the house. That's what it's called. Um, really awesome episode. And I was flipping through the channels, and uh, th it was literally just coming on. So I, I stopped. Of course, I started watching it. I'd never seen this one before, um, and I was watching it. it. It was cold. It was early. It was the bit my big old house, which you know I have great memories in. You know that was an awesome house. Um, and uh, I was just sitting there. It was, so, it was the atmosphere. I can't really explain uh, the atmosphere and the you know how it felt back then. That's that's what makes this memory so awesome and this moment so much better than it would be if I just seen it you know any other regular day. But for some reason, this day was just a, an awesome atmosphere and awesome everything. Uh, I wish I could explain it better, but I just can't. It's one of those things that um, are just in your memory and that's it. Um, so yeah, I was watching it, uh, the, uh, the woman, uh, kills, it, it opens up with the woman killing her husband on Christmas Eve or whatever, um, and, uh, I thought that that's where it was gonna go, you know, she was just killing her husband or, or, or 
whatever, and it was going to be an episode like that. She's dragging her husband's body out into the yard where the well is. She's going to throw it down the well. Then the radio cuts uh, cuts to Christmas music, and it, it cuts to a, you know, breaking news type, uh, bulletin type news thing, and they're like, you know, a, a crazy guy has escaped in a sand asylum, um, you know, he's a killer, uh, he's wearing a Santa Claus suit, and, uh, this whole moment, this whole scene is just, is, is just a moment, it's really awesome, and, uh, that, that, I remember that really creeped me out, she's out there, uh, her husband comes back to life, he grabs her, um, eventually she, she fixes that. Then she hears some like jingle bell type things, you know, some like Christmas bells. And, uh, she's, she's looking around like saying who's there and stuff. And then what happens is, uh, this is the specific moment and, um, she's walking and, uh, it, it's kind of, it's kind of a jump scare and, and she's walking one way and then she goes to turn around and bam, the, the Santa Claus guy's right there. You know, she bumps into him, and he's super creepy, and that moment scared the hell out of me back then. Um, uh, it, it was a perfect jump scare. It got, it got me. Uh, that whole episode is really badass and creepy. I love that episode. Um, it, there's plenty of moments I could have even picked in that episode, you know, uh, when she's in the closet and she sees the ladder come up, and uh, my phone's ringing. I'm going to ignore that. But uh, the le she sees the Santa Claus guy um, coming up the ladder, going to her daughter's room. That's really creepy. I could have picked so many moments from that. Uh, this, the, the, you know, the, my favorite horror Christmas horror movie is Gremlins. Uh, but the moment in this movie just is stands out to me so much. is is just an amazing uh, horror moment. And uh, it's like I said, it's not just a moment. It's the the memory of the moment and what was going on in my life at that time and where I was living and the atmosphere, um, just the, the nostalgic memory, everything about it is just awesome. I never want to forget that memory. So cool. So fun. And, uh, you know, it was just really awesome. Hopefully this counts, Richard. I know it's kind of long. Um, my bad, you know, but I had to kind of set up the memory, you know, the, the atmosphere as much as I could. I, you know, I really didn't even touch it, what the, what it really was, um, it, it, it's such an awesome, I, I miss that house. That house was just awesome. I wish I could go back there. It doesn't exist anymore. Uh, but yeah, so that, that's, um, that's it guys. Uh, hopefully this wasn't too, uh, you know, away from what you wanted. Um, if it is, I can do another one. I could do an actual movie instead of a TV show. Just let me know, dude. And, uh, hopefully you don't, you can sit through this entire video and I keep just making it longer cause I'm still talking. Anyway, check out Richard's channel below. Enter this contest, badass contest. See you guys later.